we have moved our master program engineering and policy analysis to The Hague. So we have some 250 students working here and studying here, living here. But they are very interested in policy issues. So the global policy issues to do with climate and water and energy transition. I and mean, we have a policy modeling lab here. It's hugely attractive for the students because they're here, they're walking around where it really happens. We have uh, Interpol, Europol, the OPCW, we have the courts. And they all need information technology, they need computers, they need data, and they're all interested in blockchain. So these are the things that we are looking at and we, we're trying to move towards the Hague in the 21st century. So that's a real challenge and, and I think Delft can contribute to that. We arrived uh, to, to The Hague 16 years ago and we started working at the International Tribunal for the Former Yugoslavia. It's a fresh start in our lives. And uh, Tatiana moved uh, to the Special Tribunal for Lebanon. I moved to the OPCW, the Organization for the Prohibition of Chemical Weapons. In 2013, our organization has won the Nobel Peace Prize and I have been in charge of our Syria operations in the field. The Hague is known as the international capital of the law. When it comes to the family, I think it's a perfect city to raise your family. Good schools, good uh, facilities for kids. It is plenty of everything, so this is how I see my city of The Hague. <laughs> Success in the ethicist's eyes is different from how fast can you get your algorithm um, to market. Technology doesn't just happen to us. We as citizens have the chance to stand up and decide the kinds of technologies that we want. You know, in order for citizens to be able to say something about the technology, they have to know what's out there. We have a program called Just Robotics, which is really creating a quality mark for artificial intelligence and robotics. What Fairtrade did for coffee, we are trying to do that for robotics and artificial intelligence. So Tech Mahindra is one of the largest Indian IT services companies. <laughs> Our company is responsible for IT software development, management, operations and support. One of the reasons that we are in The Hague is as a very, very international, expat-friendly city. Our key customers are all based in The Hague. For us, customer proximity is very, very important. Other than our customers being here in The Hague, is some of the big congresses that the city of The Hague has been organizing. So we are very happy with the investments of The Hague. When I became a father and I thought of, okay, how, how do I want to leave the world behind for my kids? As an engineer, I'm thinking, okay, how can I use that expertise, contribute to a better world? The first project we did was with Greenpeace. How can we get video images of palm oil fires? And yeah, that we fixed with an with a autonomous flying drone. Well, the Hague is pretty cool in the way they support us. So, so for instance, we're now here in the Hague at uh, Binkhorst, which is an area they're gonna transform into like the new Silicon Valley. I think that the environment in The Hague is pretty good for startups.